Hi, and welcome back to Kiki's Fun Animal Camp. My name is Joe, I'm your narrator, and today we're going to be talking about the Rock Hyrax. All hyrax species are actually part of the clade Penungulata, meaning they are distantly related to both elephants and manatees and dugongs. They all three share a common ancestor. Rock hyraxes live in groups called colonies that can contain as many as 50 individual members. Colonies of rock hyraxes will actually be split up between separate harems, with one male guarding over about five to seven females. Colonies of Hyraxes actually all share the same bathroom. They're habitual bathroom users, meaning they use the same bathroom spot over and over again every time. Colonies of Hyraxes also share the babysitting duty. Different mothers will take care of the groups of young while the others are off feeding. Rock hyraxes have incredible eyesight, meaning that they can spot a predator from over 1,000 yards away. Their predators might include leopards, eagles, hyenas, jackals, and a variety of other predators of the savanna. A hyrax's stomach, similarly to elephants and manatees and dugongs, is a multi-chambered stomach, 
which includes the sesum, which is a part that contains bacteria for digesting plant matter. Hyraxes very rarely drink water. In fact, most of the time they get their water from the plants that they eat. Hey Joe, hey, I know that your video high rocks, but I'm gonna squeeze in here to say that despite the clips, Hyraxes actually don't move that much. They spend 95% of their time just not moving. Thank you for joining us on another episode of Kiki's Fun Animal Cam. My name is Joe, I've been your narrator, and I hope you have a good day.